The Douglas DC-5, despite its impressive design and adaptability, struggled in the commercial market, overshadowed by more established airliners like the Lockheed Model 18 Lodestar and its own sibling, the Douglas DC-3. Even so, the DC-5 did find its niche in short-haul routes and feeder services, which took advantage of its excellent short-field performance. KLM Royal Dutch Airlines and KNILM, an airline based in the Dutch East Indies, were among the few to operate this aircraft for civilian purposes. An interesting fact is that the first DC-5, built for KLM, was the 5000th Douglas Transport. This aircraft was named Icevogel, or Kingfisher. Despite the challenges, the DC-5 was appreciated by its crews for its easy handling and passengers for its comfortable seating arrangement, setting a new standard for air travel comfort during that era. The influence of the DC-5 extended beyond its limited production run. Its high wing configuration and tricycle landing gear became popular features adopted in future aircraft designs. The DC-5 was also the first Douglas airliner to have a flight engineer as part of its standard crew, a role that became crucial in the operation of more complex aircraft that followed. In fact, the DC-5's design directly influenced the development of the Douglas DC-6 and DC-7, two of the most successful propliners of the post-war era. The legacy of the DC-5 can therefore be traced in the DNA of these and other iconic Douglas aircraft. The Netherlands holds a special place in the story of the DC-5, not just because KLM was the initial customer, but also because the DC-5 had a significant impact on Dutch aviation history. The aircraft's speed and range were instrumental during the evacuation of civilians and military personnel from the Dutch East Indies during World War II. In fact, one of the DC-5s operated by KNILM, registered as PKADA, had a unique role as the personal aircraft of Prince Bernhard of the Netherlands, who used it for official visits and inspections. While no original DC-5 aircraft have survived to the present day, there are ongoing efforts to preserve the memory of this unique aircraft. One such endeavor is the DC-5 project in Australia, which aims to construct a full-scale replica of the DC-5. This ambitious project has been painstakingly researching and recreating the aircraft's design, based on original blueprints, photographs, and first-hand accounts from people who flew and maintained the DC-5. Additionally, the ongoing search for the remains of the Dutch One aircraft, stranded on a remote beach in Australia during World War II, continues to captivate the aviation community. If found and recovered, it could serve as a priceless historical artifact and potentially be restored for display in a museum, providing a tangible connection to the remarkable story of the DC-5. The Douglas DC-5, although relatively obscure, has made a few appearances in popular culture over the years, further solidifying its place in aviation history. From historical accounts to dramatic retellings, the aircraft's roles and exploits have been brought to life in various forms of media. For instance, the DC-5's evacuation mission during the Japanese invasion of Java has been depicted in several books and documentaries, offering a thrilling account of the aircraft's agility and speed in high-stakes scenarios. One notable example is the book The Douglas DC-5 by aviation historian Charles E. Skilton, which provides a comprehensive history of the aircraft, including its role in the evacuation of Java. Moreover, the DC-5 has been immortalized in the form of scale models, collectibles, and even video games, allowing aviation enthusiasts to appreciate the unique design and history of the aircraft in a more interactive manner. These models, often painstakingly detailed, serve not just as decorative pieces but also as educational tools, introducing new generations to the rich history of aviation. Despite its limited production and relatively brief service history, the Douglas DC-5 left a lasting impression on the aviation industry. Its innovative design, versatility, and adaptability for various roles, both in civilian and military sectors, were way ahead of their time. These factors, combined with the aircraft's traumatic wartime service, ensured the DC-5 unique place in the annals of aviation history. While the DC-5 may not have achieved the fame of some of its contemporaries, its influence was felt in the designs of later aircraft, and its story continues to captivate aviation enthusiasts around the world.
This unique aircraft serves as a testament to the innovative spirit and forward-thinking philosophy of the Douglas Aircraft Company, forever reminding us of an era when the boundaries of aviation were continually being pushed and expanded.